Hi there! This week's question is, what is a power supply rail and what are they for? My name is Steve, this is the QA Weekly, and you're going to be learning a little bit more about the most important part of your computer, laptop, and other devices. Computers and just about every other electronic out there uses direct current, DC, and not AC. All of our homes, however, are powered by alternating current, AC. So your power supply has to first take the input power, which is usually somewhere between 110 and 240 volts, and drop it down to a usable voltage and also convert it from AC to DC. What is a PSU rail? Well, PSU rail actually allows for that power to be dropped down from that 110 to 240 volts, depending on where you live, converted to DC from AC, but that's more specifically a different part of the PSU. And what's more important is that each of those rails inside of your power supply unit are one of the voltages that your power supply unit provides your electronics. They usually come in 3.3 volt, 5 volt, and 12 volts. Depending on the power supply and other features built into it, you may have multiple 12 volt rails, usually reserved for hard drives, graphics cards, and other devices that require a lot of power. So that is just basically what a power supply unit is. It is just one of the power conduits configured to a set voltage required by your computer. That's all a PSU rail is. Like this episode if you like it, dislike it if you didn't, share it with those you think benefit from this, and don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any questions, comments, suggestions for topics, email me at ask at cqawiki.com or go to my website, cqawiki.com, where you can see the show notes on this episode, past others, find other ways of subscribing, and of course, use the contact form to email me directly. And if you want to see me play video games, I play every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday from 7 to 9 p.m. Eastern. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.